Okay, now we're going to talk about fingerings. So you'll probably have a band method book with the fingering chart in the front or the back of the book. And it might be a little bit confusing, but you have to get the right finger combination in order to get this, the pitch that you want. Um, and so if you have a single horn, you will have one set of slides and um, only three keys, three little keys. So you will play the F horn fingerings, which is usually the top option. Um, and then if you have a double horn, you'll have two sets of slides. The, the top pipe is, the top sets of pipes are the F horn slide, single F horn slide, and the bottom slides are this, the double B flat horn slide. And um, if you push your thumb down, it'll go through the B flat horn slide. If you don't push your thumb down, you leave it up, it'll go through the F horn slide. So you basically have two options for every note, the F horn or the B flat horn fingerings. Um, but as a rule of thumb, you want to use the B flat horn, you put your thumb down, for A flat in the staff and any note higher than that. And then any note lower than that, you don't put your thumb down. So the fingering chart, you'll, it'll have like numbering system and it's, it's T, one, two, and three. So trigger or thumb and valve one, valve two, valve three, like that. So you have to put down the right finger combination in order to get that pitch. Um, and so for an example, if you see the fingering T one, two, you would go like this, thumb one, two. If you see the fingering zero, you would play it open or just don't push anything down. Okay, so we're gonna um, learn a B flat concert scale, major scale. So um, the horn is confusing also because we are not a concert pitch instrument, we are pitched in F. So even if you have a double horn, you're considered an F horn. So we have to transpose to get to concert pitch. So we count five notes up from concert pitch and that's the horn note that we play. To, in order to sound the same as everyone else in the band. So we're going to count up from B flat, B flat, C, D, E, F. We will play an F major scale. So F major is not really that great of a key for us. It's either too high or too low. So um, I'm going to, I put down um, the low octave and the high octave and whatever one is easiest for you, that's what you can play. And I just wrote down the, the single F horn fingerings because I know everyone will have an F horn, a single F horn, and maybe not everyone will have a double horn. Okay, so the first note sounds like this. That's our low F. So I'll play the scale for you and you can follow along and copy my fingers. Okay, here we go. And if that's too low for you, you can try the upper octave. So here we go, starting on the, low, the note that we left off. That's just like a really bad key for you for beginning horns. I'm going to just do a really easy key for us, which is the key of C, no sharps and no flats. And it's more, not as high, not as low. Uh, so I'll, this is the octave I'll play for you. The first note is C, open. And the F horn fingerings, I'll play the scale for you. There you have it.